Good morning. Welcome to the Daily Office, and thank you for joining me. This is morning prayer for Monday, August the 15th. It's the 13th week after Pentecost and week 7 in our psalm cycle. And today we celebrate St. Mary the Virgin. The scripture for this service, Psalm 106, verse 1 through 18, and Luke chapter 1, verse 46 to 55. And now please join me in singing verse 4 of Psalm 100 by Isaac Watts to the tune of Old 100. Our God is good, our God is kind, whose grace is great and mercy sure, and the whole race of truth from age to age endure. Open my lips, my mouth shall declare your praise. Hallelujah! Oh, give thanks to the Most High, for God is good, for God's mercy endures forever. Hallelujah! Psalm 106, and please recite it with me. Hallelujah, O oh, give thanks to the Most High, for God is good, for God's mercy endures forever. Who can declare the mighty acts of God? Who can show forth all of God's praise? Blessed are they that are just, and those that do what is right at all times. Remember me, O oh God, with the favor that you bear your people. O oh, visit me with your salvation, that I may see the good of your chosen, that I may rejoice in the gladness of your nation, that I may glory with your inheritance. We have sinned as our ancestors did. We have committed iniquity and acted wickedly. They did not understand your wonders in Egypt. They did not remember the abundance of your love, but provoked you at the Red Sea. And nevertheless you saved them for your name's sake, that you might make your mighty power known. You rebuked the Red Sea, and it was dried up, and you led them through the depths as through a desert. And you saved them from those that hated them, and redeemed them from the hand of the foe. And the waters covered their enemies, there was not one of them left. And then they believed your words, and they sang your praise. But they soon forgot your works, they waited not for your counsel, but lusted exceedingly in the wilderness, and tempted you in the desert. And yet you gave them their request, but set leanness into their soul. They envied Moses in the camp, and Aaron, your holy one. And the earth opened and swallowed Dathan, and covered the company of Abiram, and a fire was kindled in their company, and the flame burned up all the wicked. Glory to you, source of all being, eternal word and Holy Spirit, as in the beginning, so now and forever. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Give thanks to the Most High, for God is good, for God's mercy endures forever. Hallelujah. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Luke chapter 1, beginning at verse 46. Mary's Psalm. And Mary said, My soul magnifies the Lord, and my spirit rejoices in God my Savior. For he has looked with favor on the lowliness of his servant. Surely from now on all generations will call me blessed. For the Mighty One has done great things for me and holy is his name. His mercy is for those who fear him from generation to generation. He has shown strength with his arm. He has scattered the proud in the thoughts of their hearts. He has brought down the powerful from their thrones and lifted up the lowly. He has filled the hungry with good things and sent the rich away empty. He has helped his servant Israel in remembrance of his mercy according to the promise he made to our ancestors, to Abraham and Sarah, and to his descendants forever. 
And Mary remained with Elizabeth about three months and then returned to her home. Here ends the lesson. And now let us offer our prayers and petitions. Please say the response after each verse. Defend us, and we shall shout for joy, for we put our trust in you. Merciful God, teach us your ways. Keep us from all sin today. Save your people and bless your inheritance. Feed us and lift us up forever. We sing of your power and mercy in the morning. You are our refuge in times of trouble. We place our hope in you, for with you is mercy and plenteous redemption. Every day we bless you. We praise your name forever and ever, and for all of your intentions. Our beloved, which art in heaven, holy is your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. Forgive us as we forgive others. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Let us pray. We give you thanks, Almighty God, and sing your praise. Look with favor upon your people and guide us in the paths of truth and justice. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Hallelujah! This is the day that God has made. Let us rejoice and be glad in it. Hallelujah! And glory to God, whose power working in us can do infinitely more than we can ask or imagine. Glory to God from generation to generation, in the church and in Christ Jesus, now and forever. Amen. Hallelujah!